is Shaky Kelly with the board for the first time in the reception too. I'm not in the church. They were not ready. I was, so it's gonna be next week. That's okay. I accept it. It's not because I'm ready that everybody is ready. So I know that I am in advance of my time, but I don't gonna stand where I am and do nothing about it when I know things that it's important for you to know. So here's five things that I need to talk about right now and I'm gonna try to make this video short and short and sweet and clear right on the target. Huh? So number one is AdWords. If you see that on my YouTube channel I raise my views and everything, it's because I finally, after three years, I was able to unblock because I was blocked to do it. So I unblock outward and I try to understand all the how it work and everything and it's really complex, you know? all the bidding and stuff like that but I really am grateful for AdWords but one thing is that I invest a whole lot money that I don't have but I believe that by investing in my divine life mission purpose it will come back to me and it always will it always it all it's always happening you know in everything what i invest is i invest in my in food in healthy food i receive back uh, i am um, every area of my life since i become my greatest version so adwords stop running because i owe them 300 dollars or something like that and out of nowhere you know uh, uh, I don't know I don't know but I know that I don't have that three hundred dollar to unblock out at work that's why my two new video are low views it's simple as that number two Oh yeah, uh, and I'm gonna fix it. Uh, eventually, it's gonna unblock again. Okay, uh, like I said, I'm in advance of my time, so uh, I I have tendency to rush uh, too much, too fast. Uh, so I need to slow down and take it all in because that's the thing happened in December and now in January, and um, I need to deal with it in slow motion okay so number two my unbreakable fl the sport that i make freeline skate what happened i break my unbreakable freeline and i finally fix them and uh, they are ready to roll but uh, i'm not quite sure that they are uh, the final version um, I don't try them yet but uh, very shortly like here now it's uh, minus 25 or something like that it's really cold so it's not the time to do that even if it's sunshine so number three it's sensibility Yes, with all the change, uh, the climate change, the alignment of the planet and uh, the uh, evolution of mankind and ourselves in the environment that we are in. More that we work on ourselves, we're gonna become more sensitive because the whole point of working on ourselves it's to be sensitive to the real, to the reality, huh? to what is truly real. 
Why? Because we were born uh, into a system of our parents that they are not sensitive. They are disconnected from the reality. Uh, I grew up listening to my parents uh, talking all the time about the news. Watching news morning, afternoon, night. And you know what? My parents are still alive and they are still the same. They are still doing the same. Even if I have all this knowledge and all this will and all this angelic God power inside of me, even if I try to explain them and stuff like that, they still laugh at me and they don't believe it. So, you know, I become more sensitive to that and why I say that is because we need to adapt to this sensitivity. It does not happen uh, the next morning. You need to gradually feel and move by expanding your comfort zone. I uh, discovering uh, who you truly are, you know? It takes a whole lot of discipline, a whole lot of time, precious time, but remember one thing, everything that you do for your own spiritual growth affect everybody around you and when you put your heart into the driver's seat of your body you have nothing to worry about but you're gonna be tested huh? uh, uh, till that the ego don't show up you know I should put ego on the board I'm gonna put ego on the board say six ego Okay, I'm gonna talk about the ego. I don't wanna mix too much the thing. So, sensitivity. Okay? Adapt to everything what takes place at the present moment. Uh, don't try to... If it really doesn't work, you know, you try one time, you try two times, you try three times, but if it doesn't go nowhere, it is, you're just blocked. Like, do something else, out of nowhere, you know, try to create something else. Because we people, with our heart, we do creative stuff. We don't have time to small, small talk and, and do only parties and do nothing about our life. Life is, the humanity need us to do things that it's gonna have an impact not only for us but for everybody around us okay blessing number four blessing it's all about how grateful we are of what we have right now always keep that in mind that if you are able to stand to walk to run to do sports, to train, to speak your truth, to do what you have to do and just be who you truly are, your true authenticity and not be discouraged, discouraged by people around you that does not approve what you're saying, you know, uh, there is always gonna be uh, people that they don't support you, but these are only the contrast. You don't need to uh, put energy towards it, you know, just let it be and it's gonna fade away. You stay focused, you know, uh, nobody gonna try to get out of your lane when you do what you're supposed to do. Oh yes! Shake it, Caleb! Style with the blackboard! First time! <clears throat> I got a lot of, lots of things to talk about, but I think I do pretty good right now. 
what do you think let me know if you like this I will make it as much as I can so number five is beyond the illusion you know when everything change we don't see the things the same you know like every day change but especially when uh, planet retrograde in a certain angle and in a, in a certain signs you know like I am a Taurus so if it 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 come into Taurus and you know it it's gonna affect my Taurus side and my ascendant side is Gemini so it work like this you know depends of the alignment of each planet uh, at a certain time in the month and stuff like that it's gonna affect you uh, in that characteristic of the Taurus and the Gemini so you need to see beyond the illusion because the illusion it looked like everything is beautiful or everything is chaos but you need to see right through it there is a, a, a middle you know like when I say shoot right at the target don't miss your shot uh, to get inspired it's because there is so much information now on planet earth that come out in all kinds of ways and who knows where the source come from and everything and who to trust you know but the thing is that if you trust yourself if you you put your heart into the driver's seat of your body and you believe you and all the sign align that you do what you're supposed to do and everything fall into place and so you your life you live beyond the illusion and that's the point of life it's to see all the time beyond the illusion I remember me in the past I was always living in illusion I escaped the reality put your hand up if you escape the reality not me anymore I say enough in 2014 I put my foot down and I say it doesn't work life like this I need something to change and I asked for it and I got it so be careful what you wish for it's like I always dream since I clean church one and the reception room one I say I wish I can have a second reception room and a second church and I try I go see uh, other church and everything but they never call me back and I I give up I give up and one day in November I receive a phone call and here I am with the blackboard cleaning reception room 2 and next week for the first time church 2 oh yes of course I gonna make a video of course but you know see beyond the illusion it's awesome it's beautiful because the only way you can see beyond the illusion is when you put your heart into the driver's seat of your body if you let your ego rule your world you're never gonna be able to see beyond the veil you're gonna think that you see beyond the veil but it's not true it's not the reality like if and this is really important what I'm gonna say and I should put it on the board I gonna put it it's another another one seven um, 
how to call it. I, you know, um, fuck. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gonna call it stuff. Okay. So move. Let's move beyond the illusion. And now we're at six. The ego. The ego là, is the, your worst enemy. You don't need the ego to thrive in life. The only thing you need is to be in your heart 24-7. And I don't gonna say put your hand up because I know that there, there is not many people who can raise their hand up on that, okay? And even me, I cannot put my hand up I cannot make it now 24-7. My always my ego sometimes gonna it's gonna come all with the, 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 the bad plan, the bad scenario. Why? And I know why. It's because of the choice that we make and the situation that we place ourselves at the present moment. Consciously or unconsciously. That's what I can say about that. So the ego, beware of it. And if you fuel yourself with, you know, the ego like stuff. Number seven, the ego like stuff. What kind of stuff the ego like? The ego like you to be confused. He like that. You take drugs, alcohol, and wasting time. Like, you know, I, I play video game all my life, but it's a big waste of time. When you know that life on planet Earth, it's a, a game, you know, and you know this is more worthy than play a virtual game. That's what I learned along my journey. So, the stuff I was talking about when I was speaking about the illusion, it's that don't try to hide the truth. It's like a cover up, you know? Like it's dirty at your house, you're gonna like clean halfway and make it like it's it's good enough, you know? But that's not how to live your life. The effect of you botching the cleaning does not gonna serve you. If you wanna feel better, because the purpose of me talking to you is for you to have better idea of what really take place right now. So, what you need to do is to do it properly. Everything what you do, you need to do it with your heart. I know it seems pretty easy like I said, but it's really not. It take me three years to be able to talk like this. It's a long process and I'm just starting. You know, I get this board here, but there is another board down there. Wait to see that one. That's another level, but I don't want to skip any level. Because I need to accept the process that where I am right now. And this is where I am right now. So, you have 30 days, okay? Not exactly 30 days. Uh, let's rewind that, okay? Let's just say from the new moon to the full moon, you have this period of time to deal with certain things 
and the way you're gonna react and the action that you're gonna take gonna affect the result in the next month and it, it go on and go on like this For all my life, I was living with my karma. You know, I was living with bad intention. I was, um, I let myself be controlled by society and the people around me. And I was a bad person because I let myself be like that. And when I, I finally, have a clear moment because it happened you know when you get hit all the time by shit sometimes you you pray that something happened you know and now you see a, the light and i see the light in 2014 and i say i never gonna go back again i never gonna be a bad guy anymore it, it's not serving nothing. It's useless. It's a use of energy, it's a use of time. And I know that there is a lot of people that can say the opposite of what I'm saying. But here is a man that proves that love is more powerful than anything. So, grab my hand and join me in this beautiful adventure in 2017 and so on and so on in the years to come. In the world made 100% of love, Tribe City, in union, we're gonna be able to create a world without ego and without useless stuff made of illusion and we're gonna be grateful to be more sensitive by doing things that we love and of course we're gonna share with share it with the world and we're gonna grow and grow and grow so this is it this is it. this is the energy update it is what it is I'm really happy that I shared that with you and I'm gonna keep in touch uh, as much as I can uh, like I always does since 2014 oh yeah and i should put eight here just for fun just for, for finish for fun eight my swag my swag yeah i change my style of how i dress myself why because it's important that when you upgrade, when you when you grow, that you let go of the old and move to the new, you know? Not I'm not talking about the age, you know? I'm talking about the energy in the energy that you are. Okay? So what I wear right now is a new shirt, uh, Reebok CrossFit, and it's awesome. For real love, for real. Oh yes. And I start wearing uh, some really clean jacket, you know, uh, and it make me and it give me more confidence. And this shirt here is like. It's like if I don't have a shirt. I can feel everything and you know, sensitivity. It's important to feel. It's important to 
feel what we experience. So, you know, uh, I don't know everything. I know a little bit of what really takes place right now uh, on planet Earth. And I accept that it is what it is. And I am grateful for your support. Please subscribe. Huh? Let's grow bigger all together. And you're gonna have updates. You're gonna see when I, I, I put out there a, a video. And you're gonna be the first to watch it. And uh, don't be shy to comment because I am a, a people person, you know. Uh, I don't judge, you know, I, I accept whatever takes place, you know, I, I really learn from the mistake of my past, so uh, I'm not a bad guy, I'm a good guy, and I like to be like that, and I know that you like that I am like that, so uh, like this video, and uh, share it huh? uh, it's a time for uh, that we unite so even if you don't resonate with what I say share it and who knows maybe three of three four person that you know that's gonna that gonna like my video and it's gonna help me you know and that's okay and if it's not that's okay too so uh, I was supposed to do a short video but I did more but I'm really grateful that I made it and uh, this is only the beginning so have a good awakening uh, ascension energy evolution Shake it, clip, style. Oh, yes. Everything I can to make things, to make things, to make things right. Shake your Caleb style. Oh yes, 2017. You gotta love it with my CrossFit outfit, with my yellow boxer. Oh yeah. Some of that bang bang shoot right at the target don't miss your shot get inspired by shikikilib style oh yeah